All right, what's going on, guys? Willis here, back with another Destiny 2 video. Obviously, before this video begins, if you're new to the channel, consider subscribing and turning those bell notifications on. I pretty much post looters, shooter content on the channel, so Destiny, anything with loot, I'll pretty much post on the channel. Um, once again, I'm also giving away a emblem, one of the new emblems which came out, the Black Lives Matter. Um, also, I do recommend you go and support Black Lives Matter, obviously, by buying this pin yourself. I bought a few of them just to give away, but obviously, if you can, make sure you can go buy some from the Bungie store. If you guys would like a chance to win this emblem, obviously, if you want to, this isn't required, feel free to support the video with a like. Obviously, leave a comment down below, as that's where I normally pick the winners. Winners from previous video will normally be in the video description. Yeah, let's jump into today's video. So, there is a faster way to level up your season pass. I know most of the people playing right now are trying to get the sought-after uh, sword, the guillotine, and the new pulse rifle, the cold denial. Fortunately, this requires you to be level 45 to actually get this engram. Obviously, you can get this. I think it's at level 35, 40, correct me if I'm wrong. But uh, these are both really powerful weapons in the game. Probably the most powerful currently. Just because cold denial is just nuts in uh, PvP. The default uh, rolls that you can get on them are just nuts. Obviously, if you want to open up this engram, you will need to obviously have them both unlocked on the season pass. Now, this method's been around for ages. Um, I've only just realized that, wait, that's probably the fastest way to level up. So, what you need to do. So, head over to Eris on the moon. And basically, what you want to do is you want to buy all of the extra bounties. Don't buy the ones she normally has. Just buy the extra ones. And it'll normally give you stuff like submachine gun kills, arc damage kills... It'll be like hand cannon kills. And you can literally do these super quick. You can finish all of these bounties in like a minute. Maybe a minute and a half. Uh, if you run over to one of the lost sectors. Which is here on the map. Obviously it's super close to where Eris is. And you can see where this is kind of going. Literally grab all of the extra bounties. Go over. Complete them. They'll literally take you seconds. You can already have the weapons equipped. Like submachine gun. I was using the risk runner. Obviously for the arc damage. And the submachine gun kills. Which was a bounty that was coming up super frequently. So I didn't really have to switch anything off. Obviously grenade kills are super easy. Um, I was playing as the striker titan. With the top tree for the extra grenade. And it was just super quick. Honestly I was getting like 10k XP. Every like minute or two. It was nuts. By far the fastest way to level up and obviously earn the guillotine sword and the new pulse rifle. Go and do this right now if you guys are just looking to catch up with season pass levels. I know it's like boring as hell to do this. Um, a lot of people actually did this a few seasons ago just to get the highest light level in the game. Um, obviously they did it for days on end and you can kind of see obviously it pays off if you uh, weren't one of the people who stacked a crap ton of bounties. Uh, but yeah, if you've pretty much done everything for the week and you just want to try and max out your season pass or even just get the guillotine or the new pulse rifle if you haven't got them yet, this is what you want to be doing. Once again, go pick up the extra bounties from Eris on the moon. Head over to the lost sector, which I'm showing in the video. Run through it. Don't complete it. Honestly, you don't need to kill the boss. It's pointless. You don't get any XP from finishing the lost sector. So just go in, complete the bounty and then leave. Go and pick up the bounties again and rinse and repeat. Most of the time, it'll be like submachine gun kills, hand cannon kills, arc damage kills. It'll sometimes be void. Um, it'll be like orbs of light, which are super easy to do if you have like master wicked weapons like the recluse. So here's an example. If you get bounties where it's like submachine gun kills, void damage and generate orbs, you can do that with literally just the recluse. Obviously, the recluse's void damage is a submachine gun and it makes orbs of light. So you're pretty much just getting three bounties at once from getting like 20 kills. It's nuts. If you get some of the bounties to line up, you can honestly do them in under a minute and you're getting like 10k XP a minute. It's nuts. Like I said, go do this now if you're still after the stuff. I'll leave you guys with some gameplay actually showing you how quick I actually complete these bounties and how quick you can actually earn that guillotine and the new pulse rifle. So, hope you guys enjoyed. Once again, support the video with a like. Leave a comment down below if you guys would like a chance to win that Black Lives Matter emblem. Obviously, go support the cause if you can by buying the pin from the Bungie uh, store. And I'll see you guys in my next video. This has been Willis Gaming and peace.
Welcome, my friend. Use it well. Approach me slowly, slowly. I have learned to 